All right, everyone, welcome back to another episode of Man Eater. I'm Captain Beefy with the Game Vault here. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel. Ring that bell for notifications. Don't forget to leave a comment and a like on the video down below. Let us know what you think. And share us on social media. It's greatly appreciated. So we are back in this initial area. Fautic Bayou. 64% done. Which is pretty solid for this little uh, region. Oh, look at this. Got a landmark. Remember, when planning a cemetery, try to avoid high risk coastal areas. Oh, well, that sucks. Um, <laughs> yeah, so we're just trying to clear this little area out. For the most part, at least get what we can out of it, and then we'll move on. Oh, wow. Elder. So there's something beyond adult. Cool. Yeah, I don't know how much exploring we did, so I'm trying to map things out. We're going to go this way, and then we're going to go... Ooh. Got another landmark there. And we're going to go get that landmark, so... basically what we're doing and in the meantime we're going to eat everything that we come across because we are a shark oh that was nice like some of these cinematic moves So the game's fun. Um, the shark it's... listens determinedly for the irregular, low-frequency sound of an animal in peril. Yeah, I love animals in peril. Um, so the developers and everybody buzzed about this game before it came out, calling it a shark PG instead of an RPG, because, you know, you were a shark and you're role-playing. But I don't see very much role-playing at this point. It's just kill everything you can and eat it. Which is fine. I guess because there are elements that you can upgrade, like you saw us do the sonar and we put the tiger shark body. I guess that they consider that role playing. It's not like, uh, you know, yeah, we're avenging our mother, but. We're not, um... A single thought drives the bull shark's behavior. Eh, I could eat. Yeah, it's not like we're... If a what? group of consenting adults wants to perform cryptic rites to shadow forth the prophecy of the great old ones, <laughs> who am I to judge? Oh crap, there's that hunted gator. It's generally believed that a shark never sleeps. Ow. A complex combination of sensing devices are key to the bull shark's success as a hunter. What is that? That's a teen. There's a teen gate. Well, this is interesting. What is this? Ooh, a box. 
Mutagen 23 is certainly heating up the evolutionary arms race. Well, this is just a festival of chowder. Yeah, this was designed to help level up. Or at least acquire resources. I was curious, the yellow drops that we're getting, that's fat. So I guess we have fat, minerals, mutagen. I'm not sure what the other one is yet, but those I've got so far, so... Definitely, definitely getting some stuff for upgrades here. Is that it? Nope. Cool little area. <laughs> he looks a little derpy. Load of fish in here. Is that it? Mostly. that pretty much handles all that. So where do we want to go to next? We came from this way, I think. That's that level 15 gator that we really don't want to screw with. I think he's a level 15 as well. Damn gators are brutal. Not going to lie, I like the uh, the music. Very cinematic in how it's presented. You see there's like not much going on, just some light background. 
light background noise right now. Attacking a fish, no change. See, just a little steady background noise, but watch. Here's an aggressive fish. Those gators were a fighting. nervous influx is communicated to the shark's brain. It recognizes that a potential meal is near. Oh, building up lots of stuff, lots of minerals and all that fun stuff. I guess we get minerals from the turtle shell. That makes sense. And from the fish, you get mostly fat. So that's from the fish oil. that all right so we've got a looks like a landmark in there we haven't been around here before this looks like it could be the way in Find a way up there. And there it is. In spite of their reputations as wrestlers, Ooh. alligators haven't mastered the nuances of scientific holds like the figure four. Look at that. So we get 10% more proteins. 10% more health on feeding. So those are proteins. Well, isn't that awesome? So we got our first new uh, upgrade for the body. Yikes. It's a shock. It's a gator. It's like a really bad sci-fi music uh, movie. Shock versus shock versus gator. Made completely in Boston. Lots of shacks. In its own kingdom, a shark can appear invincible. Yeah, well, we're not so invincible here. I don't believe we've died yet, but we've come close a couple times. Oh, look.
think we got some stuff. Let's see what this is. You can go to hell, alligator. That was a license plate. Next one's over that way. Is this? Another one of these little spots, huh? Ooh, Barracuda. Sharks are cloaked with a singular aura of terror. Now we'll eat some Barracuda. Chomp, chomp. I like that thrash thing. Lots of them in here. Oh, lots of group or two. Look at this. Oh, yeah. Protein patches like this one are a convenient and tasty way for sharks to increase their protein intake. Goodbye, Barracuda. Still just a teen, though. I'm just a little teeny shark. Anything else in here? Head on out. So that was kind of badass. Now, what is this? Bayou Buddies. Is that on my list? No, it's not. Oh, that's where we got the uh, thing. It's closed down. All right. Let's see what else we can find around here. Anything show up? Nope.
Hello, little turtle. Oh my god. Looks like they're chewing on him. Got him. Nice. Well, we can definitely handle a little gator a lot better now. Let's try it again. We should have healed first. Let's go back and get him now. That was close. <laughs> I think we almost died there. All right. Well, cool. Let's get ourselves healed up. And out of this area. And then we'll go apply the new... Uh, body part organ whatever it is and do whatever leveling up we can because that'll be cool so away we go fast traveling home man eater what a game the shark returns once again to her safe haven Even the shark has a base. That's freaking hilarious. All right, so I choose that. And then we can upgrade it. So, oof, why not? upgrade this oh my goodness we can get more fats proteins minerals and mutagens I'll take it tier 4 body it's better than my body in real life ha 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 oh we're pretty close to being able to do this too well crap let's go get let's go eat a couple more things real quick We need those uh, aggressive fish. So one thing I've done from the beginning pretty much is... And I'm glad because I see the amount of stuff that's required to... Uh, oh, there's something aggressive over here. To level up, it looks like that is definitely the trick. Here we go. Nope, not over 10,000 yet. But we're close. The 
natural lateral movement of the shark's head allows her to more precisely locate potential prey. That and the super cool sonar that you gave her. Right, we're close. Gator. Yeah, one of those hunted ones. Still not quite ready for that. In the 1920s, you could buy turtle soup in a can. Of course, back then, there was a high chance you'd die of tuberculosis. So there are trade-offs. Wow. The dark humor is real. Here we go. Reckon him. Oh, he's running. Couple hundred from him. So it looks like since I did that level up, I don't have to eat all the pieces that fall off of him, which is a huge help. All right, well, we're almost there. Ten thousand, that's all I need. Ah, let go. Hey, you want to thrash me? I'll thrash you right back. And I'll eat your little friend. Hell yeah. There's our 10,000. Alright, we're going home. The grotto provides a brief respite from the Sturm und Drang of the Gulf. And let's do our sonar. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. So we've got level 4 body, 20% 20, 20 more of everything that we get passively. That's freaking awesome. 200% sonar and a 40% less cooldown on the uh, advanced sonar. And our protein digestion is pretty cool. What's next on that? 12,000. I should have waited for that, but that's okay. Um, yeah, that'll bring us up to 20% health and 20% proteins, which is cool. We can do it. What? Oh, no, we can't. So that's only 8,000 of those. All right, so we're going to have to eat a bunch of turtles. Cool. Well, it's about that time. Thanks for joining me for another episode of Man Eater. As always, I'm Captain Beefy with the Game Vault. If you haven't done so, please subscribe to the channel. Ring that bell for notifications. Don't forget to leave a comment and a like on the video down below. And share us on social media. We'll see you next time. See, you saying goodbye. <laughs>